Hello and welcome to this tutorial. My name is Thilo. In this tutorial we will work with two different effect layers. For the first layer we will use the SC color scroll and for the second layer we will use the SC plasma effect. The first layer should be renamed to layer 1 and the second layer to layer 2. Furthermore, we want to have a look at the impact of the order of the effect layers. Now let us start. We will work with an empty storage place. In my example it is storage place 1 at storage 1 on deck A. By the way, all empty storage places in matrix consist of one effect layer which is assigned to the SCE color effect with a black color. In this tutorial we want to change the effect to SC color scroll for this first layer. Now we want to add a second layer, therefore we navigate to the layer button on the bottom left side, perform a right click and we select new in the context menu. A new layer will be added. For this layer we select SCE Plasma. According to our task we want to rename the layers. The color scroll layer should be renamed to layer 1 and the plasma layer to layer 2. To rename a layer we select the desired layer tab button and perform a right click to bring up the context menu. In the context menu we select rename and we type layer 1 and OK. Another way to rename a layer is performing a double click at the desired layer tab button. And we rename it to layer number 2. Now let us have a look how the visual output will be changed if we change the order of the layers. To change the order we select the desired layer with the left mouse button and move it to the left or right side. As we now can see layer number 1 that means the color scroll layer is visible because layer number 1 is now on the right side and the right side means it's in the foreground. In other words it means the more left a layer is located the more it is in the background. That's it for now. Thank you for watching.